at the poor thing in days. We must stop filling it if we are not going to have a party. <laughs> oh, hey, I've got an idea. Let's have a party. Aha. That's a great idea, Iris. We haven't had one since our congrats we cleaned out the rain gutters party last week. Oh, that's my fave! Before that, we had the thankfully it's Monday party. Followed by the thankfully it's Tuesday and then Wednesday party. Ending in the thankfully it's the weekend party. How about a thankfully it's Thursday party? We haven't had one of those yet. Plus, today is Thursday. Lovely yes. idea! Yeah. Most fun! Iris and Misery, you'll be in charge of decorations. Skullboy, you're in charge of drinks. I'll do food. Frank and Len can do music. Scaredy can do games. And Po, you can replenish the pinata. Um, <clears throat> super. <laughs> what does it do? It is tomorrow. Thankfully, we haven't had a thankfully it's the day after Thursday party yet. Let's get this party started! Woohoo! Uh, at your convenience, of course. <laughs> 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 The decorations look amazing. Thanks, Ruby. What are you looking at? Everything is going exactly as planned. Mm, delicious, Ruby, as always. Oh, oh, I landed on a thorn. Let me out of you, please. Hello? What happened? It's almost as if... Misery is everywhere all at once! Ah! Ruby? Is anyone there? It's so bright. I can't see a darn thing. <sighs> the sun is shining. The birds are singing. Yep. I'm miserable. Hmm. Odd. <sighs> Today is Friday. Maybe it's not just any Friday. That doesn't explain why I'm suddenly Mother Nature's new best friend. I was right. Today is Friday the 13th. Wait. I remember my Nana telling me a story about this day. <laughs> 11, 12, 13. Ooga! Friday 13, lucky day. <clears throat> Hello, today is Friday the 13th. <laughs> Does anyone care for a cup of my lucky Friday the 13th tea? I get it. Bad luck is normal for you, Misery. So Friday the 13th is actually a good luck day for you. Plus, the full moon has been out all day. Perhaps that magnifies the effect. It's a chance for you to experience a whole new side of life, Misery. One that isn't fraught with disaster. Ah! The rest of us will just have to stay on our toes. <gasps> We should have a Friday the 13th on a full moon is good luck for you party in honor of misery. Could someone please get me out of her first? I don't like the sound of this. Not one little bit. What you reading, Poe? <laughs> Everything you ever needed to know about Friday the 13th but were afraid to ask for a good reason. Says here, smashed chandeliers are bad luck. <gasps> oh, full moons are even worse luck. <gasps> <gasps> Fainting net scaredy three years of bad luck. Oh, that's six years. That's it. Just a little more. A little more. Then out the front door, across the big yard, and up the long flight of stairs. Hey, no 
How come I always have to do all the heavy lifting? You know I can't risk hurting my picking fingers, Len. Hey, Ruby, what you up to? I'm making a cake for Misery's Friday the 13th on a full moon is good luck for you party. And I need the smash-proof plastic cake tin. Hey, and we can try out our new songs at Misery's party. You want to hear one? I'd love to. Ah! Uh, Frank, the amp won't fit. Then we'll just play where the amp lies. Uh, guys, it's probably not a good idea to practice under a ladder. Some people believe it's bad luck. Lightning bolt almost zapped me. Talk about a close call. <laughs> yeah, believe it or not, I didn't get zapped either. I'm lucky too. If the bolt didn't zap you and it didn't zap me, who did it zap? Now I know how misery feels. Ow. Ruby, catch. Three, two, Thanks, Misery. Boy, am I ever glad you're having good luck today. That makes one of us. Shoo! Says here, open flames are bad luck, and so are books that are perched on one's windowsill. <gasps> Ow! Hey, watch it! Well, this book really knows what it's talking about. Oh, no! Open flame! No, oh, this is truly unlucky. I am now unable to study up on what unlucky events are about to befall me. How shall I ever know? Oh, oh, I suppose it will become obvious. Hey, Scanty, you're my first customer. Hello. Oh. Ah. Voila. A brand new cake for Misery's party. Darn. Ouch! Oh, stub my toe. Ah. Mm, stub it again. Double out. Ah, and again. Ah. Uh, I thought I was related to a long line of malt shop entrepreneurs, and my opening day is a flop. Oh, okay. Who keeps moving the table? I only got seven good toes left here. Do you stub your toes all the time too, Misery? You do. Happy days. Give me a double. Two squirts of chocolate coming up. <laughs> so, what seems to be the trouble today, little lady? This is the trouble. The chocolate squirt bounced off me and hit you. The bar stool didn't collapse. I stood outside in the middle of a lightning storm today and didn't get hit once. <laughs> See? I didn't choke or have an allergic reaction. Plus, I have no idea where these flowers came from. A walking, talking, good luck charm. Oh, those sure are some problems you got there. This one's on the house. It should be. I live here. I'm gonna hang this four leaf garland for the party if it kills me. Did you have to say that? Whoops. I fear someone must have left the bath running, for heaven's sakes. Well, I had to soothe my frazzled nerves. Or left the tap on in the kitchen? You gotta have clean utensils when running a soda bar. Or left the washing machine on? You know how much I like fresh socks. What's up, guys? It appears that the house is flooding, Len. Oh, that's all. Thanks, Frank. No problem. Anytime. Great. 
So, uh, did you say the house is flooding? That's what I said, Len. I said the house is flooding. Try paying attention sometime. The house is flooding! Oh, no! Ah! Ah! Oh! <laughs> the salesman said mandrake plants bring good luck. I feel so used. What do we do now? I think we better get out of here. But what about my hammock, my, my dried mosquito collection, my... Oh, my! What are you guys waiting for? Run! Guys, quick! Apparently the house is flooding. I know Friday the 13th is bad luck, but I sure didn't see that one coming. So far? We've lost 14 panes of glass due to tripping mishaps, had three losses of consciousness, and one flooded house. Perhaps we should postpone the party to a slightly safer day, perhaps? I concur, little bat. Our amp is busted, which means no music. Plus, I lost my blender in the flooding. My soda bar will have to close. And my toes can't take hanging another garland, Ruby. <sighs> Not so fast, troops. Sure, you're a bit waterlogged and had 17 degree burns thanks to the lightning. That's no reason to give up! Yes, it is. Welcome to Disaster Camp! I'm going to show you how to deal with disaster and survive. Excuse me? Uh at disaster camp, everything could go horribly awry. You bet it will. Well, if we go to disaster camp, we might get caught in a terrible storm. I know. We, we could walk across the lawn, trip on nothing, get critically injured, and be rushed to the hospital. What's your point? Oh. How long must we stay at disaster camp, Ruby? I guess until all the water is mopped up from inside the house. We're on it. We won't let you down, Ruby. Thanks, guys. Follow me, gang. Oh, dear. Oh, my. Uh-oh. We're doomed. Whew. Glad we got out of that one. That camp would have been a disaster. That's kind of the idea, Lynn. When selecting a site for your tent, make sure to watch out for quicksand. It got all of the men in my family, except for one, luckily. Okay, let's take this outside! What's this for, Misery? It's your disaster avoidance map. Everything is a possible disaster. No! Oh! A paper cut! A paper cut! Oh! Will the pain never cease? Um, most likely no. But you get used to it. Okay. Look alive, people! <gasps> This place is a disaster. Why do we have to clean it up? I gave Ruby my word. What word? The word that we do it. Do what? Clean the house, Len. Why do we have to clean it up? Just forget why you're doing it. Just wipe the floor. OK, Len? Sure. Why didn't you say so in the first place, Frank? Sheesh. Ah! Ooh. Ooh. Higher, Poe. Jump higher! My disaster training will help you survive and thrive. See? Told ya. Die, die, die! A picture frame? <laughs> but we're outside. Normally, when picture frames fall out of the sky on me, I duck way faster. I cleared the whole obstacle course in one! Next lesson, avoiding wells. Just a bit more. Those dandelions still look a little parched. Oh, that looks like fun! I want to turn! Can I? Can I? Huh? Can I please? I wonder who that black cloud belongs to. Oh, yeah! Me! Me, 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 me! It's got my name on it! That's not a rain cloud. That's... <laughs> Okay, guys, get to work. Wow! Bravo! Work of art. 
My fear of things going wrong started when I was but a baby crow, and Mother pushed me off that cliff. Oh, sure, I flew, but at what cost? When I suggested you embrace your disaster, I wasn't expecting a life story. I was just suggesting you wrap your cuts and injuries with proper bandages. So, what have we learned from this latest disaster session? Paul likes to ramble on and on? Yes, very good. Why can't people wipe the water off their feet before coming inside? I think the flood was pretty unexpected, Len. Is it so difficult to hang up your coat as you're fleeing a flood? <laughs> Is it? <sighs> I give up. Um, uh... It was a dark and stormy night. This book is most accurate. How does it end? Ah! <sighs> Sorry, no clue. I need a drink. <laughs> Not bad. We've been zapped by lightning, chased by locusts, outrun tidal waves, and survived floods. There's no disaster, big or small, that we can't handle. Yes! You are most right! Who needs good luck? Let me finish that for you. Oh, of course. Ow. Ah, uh, it must be Saturday. The 14th. <laughs> You did an amazing job. This place has never been cleaner and drier. All we ask for all our hard work is just a little thank you now and then. Thank you, Frank and Len. Is that too much to ask? Uh, Len, Ruby just said thanks. I just feel so unappreciated. And, and wipe off your shoes! Oh, right. Now that the kitchen's up and running again, who wants to help me bake a cake for the party? Ooh, ooh, me, 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 me! No eating in the Great Hall, please! Let it go, Len. What you doing with the ladder, Skull Boy? I got so used to bad luck, I kind of miss it. Ow. <laughs> Let's get this Saturday the 14th, everything's back to normal party started! Yay! Look out! Party. Party. Party tips with Doom. And Ruby. Step one to hosting a party. Invite your guests. Right, Doom? Oh, hey, Doom. What's up? Okay, let's see. You've eaten a large coconut with an imaginary friend from the Congo at noon. Pass it on. Uh, okay. Who am I to argue? Hey, what's up? No. I'm invited to have Coco with friends who play bongos at noon. Pass it on? Cool! I love bongos! I've contracted the very rare bonga bonga disease and symptoms will appear soon. Pass it on? Uh, normally, they ask me not to pass it on, but okay. Pass what on the when for poo? I now, are you sure Ruby said the party was on the moon a week Friday? Definitely. I think. <sighs> Whoops. <laughs> of course, 
It's best to put the invitation in writing so there's no confusion. 